Thank you for watching this video on the grant record changes G21 form in the updated web grant system. To navigate to the grant record changes screen, you'll click on student info under the Cal Grant section on the home page. The menu will pop up and you can click on grant record changes. Then you can search for a student by their DREAM Act ID or SSN or their CSAC ID. First, we will review an example for a new student. The top of the form remains the same with the student demographic information, educational level verification, and dependency status override. Here is the second half of the screen. An enhancement to the form is the grant data revision section. The options allow you to quickly specify the reason for submitting the G21 form. You can select to reconsider the student, withdraw the new student for financial reasons, or withdraw the new student for other reasons. We will take a closer look at this new feature. When the option Withdraw New Student for Other Reasons is selected, the ICER data fields are grayed out and you only need to enter your request in the Reasons section on how the Commission should process the student. Another enhancement is if you select that the student is now independent, the parent's data fields are grayed out to better communicate that only the student data fields need to be updated. One additional feature is you will now need to click the checkbox to certify the changes being submitted for the student. After submitting the form, you will receive the message that the change is pending CSAC approval. With the system update, the back-end processing of requests has been improved. CSAC staff reviews the request and the updates are now more automated. Now we will review the form for a renewal student. In the updated system, the form more closely mirrors the new student G21 form. The top part of the screen looks the same with the demographic information and educational level verification. However, the dependency status override has been added. The renewal student form also has the grant data revision section with the same functionality of narrowing down the fields needed for processing. Another enhancement for this form is the addition of a specific ICER number data field. The separate box for the ICER number will assist with the backend processing of the forms. After clicking Submit, you will receive the same pending CSAC approval message, and CSAC staff will review the form for your student. This video provided a high overview of the new look and feel of the Grant Record Changes G21 form. For additional training on the processes in the new system, please register for our webinars, annual statewide financial aid workshop, or regional trainings. To register, please visit our website at www.csac.ca.gov and navigate to our high school staff and college staff training sections. Please engage with us on our social media platforms. We post important updates and deadlines for schools and students. Please check out our websites for more information. If you have any questions, please contact School Support by phone or email. Thank you.